Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in to our channel once again. Today's video request is how to make YouTube Shorts thumbnail in Canva. But wait, is it actually possible to do? The answer is yes, that's what we're going to talk about right now. So to give you an outline about today's topic, here's a brief overview. Number one, how to make a YouTube Shorts thumbnail in Canva. And number two, how to use a custom thumbnail when uploading shorts to YouTube. You ready? Let's start. Okay, first, we're going to uh, go to the Create a Design button right over here. And we're going to type in YouTube Shorts. And from the drop down, we're going to select, of course, YouTube Shorts. It'll take a couple of seconds to load up, so let's wait for the editing page to load up. And here we are. All right, on the side panel, you'll see some templates that'll automatically display. You can choose from some templates over here in case you want to use one. But we're not going to be using that today, so we're going to close that. So now we're going to place our video here on the page. So we're going to go to the uploads section here on the sidebar. If you haven't uploaded your file yet, then click on the upload files button. Then navigate to the location of your video and then click open or you can double click on your video to upload it to Canva. Okay, now that it's here, we can finally add it to our page. We can do that either by dragging or clicking on it. And here you go. It'll be added to our page. You can just manually resize your video or you can right click, then select set image as video background from the drop down. And in case you want to adjust your video's placement, just double click on it and then adjust the um, placement according to your liking. Once you're done, click on done. Now it's time for us to start designing our thumbnail. Creating a thumbnail for a short is different from creating a thumbnail for a regular YouTube video. And why is that? That's because when it comes to YouTube Shorts, your thumbnail should be a part of your video. So basically, we're going to upload the full video here on Canva, and we're just going to select a portion of our video to add it to be our thumbnail. So in this case, I think we're going to choose the beginning part so that it's easier to find once we upload it to uh, YouTube later on. And we're going to start designing our thumbnail over here. So let's get started. Okay, first, um, I think I'd like to go to the element section and look for a square or a rectangle. Or maybe I could just press R on my keyboard to add a square or rectangle. And then I'm going to place that over here. I'm going to use this to emphasize our text so that more people will be curious and more people will click on our YouTube short. So I'm going to go to text and I'm going to add a text box. Or I can also just press T on my keyboard if I want to. Um, maybe we could say pancake here. I like this font though. What font is this? Val? Let's say Val. Mm, okay, maybe not. Let's try to change our font over here. So cha uh, change it to whatever font you like. We're going to change the color of our... Um, this element over here. Something like that. Resize this one and adjust the spacing. Okay, I'm going to duplicate this and type in here. Uh, just adjust the spacing. 
and change it to change the color to white add effects to it like the shadow effect and change the color of our shadow to black adjust the transparency like that duplicate this and say the best but we're gonna make best bigger and we're going to make sure that everything is aligned and then maybe we can copy this put this over here send it backward okay maybe we can make it smaller and then add recipe over here let's play okay and there we go now I'm going to add a new oh, maybe I could just duplicate it so I'm gonna press this button and click on duplicate page and here on the second page I'm going to delete all of the elements and now I'm gonna go back to the first page and I am going to um, I'm going to adjust the uh, duration for this video clip. So I'm going to click on this video and I'm going to go here and I'm going to set it to just five seconds. And I'm going to click on done. The reason for that is because I'd like this title to appear only on the first five seconds of my video. And we're going to use that portion of the video as our custom thumbnail later on when uploading the short to YouTube. So now I'm going to go to um, the next page. And since our first page was set to the first five seconds only, then we're going to subtract the first five seconds of this video clip over here. So that means we're going to um, adjust it to be 20, about 22. This is 27.8. So we're going to subtract um, 5 seconds from that. So that's 22.8. But we're going to leave an extra second. So that's going to be 22.7. We're going to click on done. Okay, to see it better, I'd like to download it now. So we're going to go to share, download. Make sure to select MP4 as your file type and adjust other settings according to your preferences and then download it. I've actually downloaded it, so let's try to play it. Okay, I think it seems okay. Now it's time for us to talk about the second part of the video and that is how to use a custom thumbnail when uploading shorts to YouTube. So let's get right on to it. Please take note, as of this moment, this option can only be done on your mobile device. So you're going to have to use your phone for this. Okay, first of all, you're going to have to save your edited video onto your phone and then go to YouTube and upload it here. So we're going to click or I mean tap on this button that looks like a circle with a plus inside of it. And then we're going to tap on create a short. From here, we'll be able to choose some videos that we would like to use as our YouTube short. And in that case, we're going to select our edited video. And here it is. You can adjust it. But to, for me, in my case, I don't want to adjust it. I'd like to keep it that way. So I'm going to click or I mean tap on done. Okay. Now you can choose to add sounds if you want to. You can also choose to flip it, speed it up a bit, set its time, and other, yeah, other things you can do. I think it's okay, so I'm going to tap this check, check circle over here. And you can add a sound, text, timeline, and filters to it. I'm 
Not going to need that today. Let's go to the next page. Okay, so before you publish your short, click on this icon that looks like a pen on the upper left side of your video's preview. So once you tap on it, you'll be able to choose a part of your video as your thumbnail. So just choose. This one would be okay for me. And once you're done, tap on done. And then you can finally upload your YouTube short with your custom thumbnail on it. And that's it for today. That's how you create a YouTube short thumbnail in Canva. And that's how you uh, customize your YouTube shorts thumbnail in YouTube. And thank you so much for watching. We really hope you found today's video of help somehow. And we look forward to seeing you again in the next video. You have a great day.